everybody. Well, it wasn't the bacon that they got. It is a young Vuvuzelas. And what jean was showing you there was the lioness who's gone back to fetch her cup had killed a little wildebeest right here, right now. It all happened very, very quickly indeed. And the little wildebeest is just in the grass there. It's not part of the um, migratory herd. It's not part of the migration. This wildebeest herd, apparently it's part of a much smaller herd of 30,000 odd, which of course in the Kruger terms is massive. The wildebeest. Here it comes. But they are resident in this area and they've just killed right now. And I think, of course, we are going to be sitting here for quite a while because we don't have to go anywhere today. And because we don't have to go anywhere today, well, what that means is that we can wait for the young cub to come back to the kill with any luck. Okay. And of course you can hear a whole lot of vehicles around. Everybody is greatly excited by what we've witnessed here today. For very good reason. Now I think what you will probably do, John Dree, is head towards those trees there if she doesn't, if they don't eat it here, I think she'll take it towards the trees. And then the cub will hopefully come back just sort of as everybody, unfortunately for them, has to clear off. We're going to be here until the end of the drive. So we've got another two hours, of course. Everyone else has got an hour. jean shall I just reposition slightly so that that bar doesn't get in the way? Wow, quite an afternoon, quite a day really. I'm just trying to help these guys get past us. I'm just going to stop here actually until everything's sort of calmed down a bit. There she is. Phew. So, I mean, as far as I know, this is the Angama Pride. We've got largely bacon eaters of course this time they're having a bit of venison and young venison veal venison if you like which is of course a little bit distasteful to some but that is what happens out here the young and infirm gets taken out yeah Aaron it really is it's cats galore day as you say we've had a magnificent day out here both at Juma and in the Mara of course and wow <laughs> I mean, I don't know what to say about this other than, wow. Okay, I'm going to reverse back a bit now. Just so that we can get a bit more space. Chandra, you shall we go back a little bit? Yeah, she's moving. I'm just going to warn you, everybody, there are a lot of vehicles here, so they might, we might get in the way, or they might sort of get in the way slightly but if I get past this fellow here very kindly parked as he is I think we'll get a nice view of him how's that John Rhee? is that alright for you? alright there we go right, we're going to wait and see what plays out here try and sort of not play bumper cars but dodge them cars Brent has got a whole lot of striped ponies streaming across the plains. You can see these zebra 